that I really enjoy. I'm really sorry to hear about what happened to you and your family, uh, family's belongings during the hurricane. Hope this small token of friendship helps. Thanks, Leon. Thanks, Leon. I put all my, my notes and my bro notes up on the wall. Kind of reminds me of you guys, you know, when I'm not making videos or not watching videos. So, that extra bag, you know what these are? These are poop bags. Take your dog for a walk, carry one of these in your pocket. Be courteous of other people. I don't want to step in crap, and I'm sure you see, you know, other people don't. So. <clears throat> I have three poop bags. Whoa! Leon, Leon, we got some tobaccos here. Holy cow. We got some, uh, Molto Dolce by, uh, what is it, Sutliff, right? I think it's a uh, product. I've had this before, a long time ago. I can't remember if I liked it. Got like a uh, brandy liquor, liqueur smell to it. I think I liked it, I can't remember. Plenty of bubble wrap. Premium aromatic, Captain Cool. Mild, mild pipe tobacco with no bite on the tongue. Lightly fragrant with a hint of vanilla. <laughs> Sounds good. Another one, it smells like it's got the, uh, smells like it got some barley in there and some, uh, liqueur casing in it. Made by, uh, McClellan's. We got, a uh, Holiday Spirit. Blend of Burley, Virginia, and Cavendish tobacco. I bet I'm going to like this. That's, like, my favorite mix right there. So. Oh, yeah. Another one. Case in that. Actually, it's got a smoky, smoky sweet smell, kind of. But that's made by, uh, oh, limited edition. Pipe tobacco. No kidding. Huh? Oh. So. Ooh, man. We got some tobaccos here. Hobbit tweed. Never tried it. Keep hearing people talk about it. Oh. Smells good. It smells real good. I can't place the smell, but it smells good. Frosty mint. Menthol one. No, oh, no, not really. It smells like dirty socks. Yeah, not Latakia dirty socks. I don't know, moldy socks or something. Christmas cookie. Oh, I love Christmas cookie. <laughs> Must have been aged for a while, Leon, huh? Some of them uh, lost their smell a little bit. That's right. Some, some of them taste better after uh, Piper's Pleasure. Never heard of this one. Some tobacco smell better after they age for a while. Get almost the same same uh, smell from all of them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mario Grande. I seen this pipe, he <clears throat> kind of asked me which one I wanted. And, uh, I really didn't want to pick because both of them was really, really cool. Um, and, uh, I picked this one because of the, uh, the stem. Mario Grande, made in Italy. Ooh, got a softy bit on it. I got. Oh, they got the original packaging. Okay, came with a rubber bit. Included the card. And, oh, a couple more rubber bits. Thank you, Leon. Could use those. There we go, you ready? Not new, but new to me. Oh, man. Video did it no, uh, no justice when he showed it to me. This is really cool, man. Almost the same size as my Boswell. So. It'll be smoked like the... 
I'll smoke the dickens out of it. Nice plateau on the top there. Some uh, <clears throat> rustication around the bottom. Uh, Mario Grande. Feta. Feta in Italy. Okay, whatever feta means. I'm sure it means uh, made in Italy. Wow. Really cool, man. Very, very, very cool. Oh, that's nice and light, too. Lighter than my Boswell. Oh, yeah. Should be smoked. Thank you very much, Leon. I'll uh, talk to you again soon. I probably won't be able to upload this for a little while, but uh, thank you. Take it easy.